This man made it to the Liverpool. Even though he was so poor, how could someone go from one of the most Colombia's deprived regions to signing 100 million deals and becoming one of the Liverpool's biggest stars? Well, this is the story of Luis Diaz. Luis Diaz grew up so poor. He was born in Barrancas, pretty close to Colombia's border with Venezuela. He is from the Vayu ethnic group in Colombia, and this group in his country always received the least attention from the government. Actually, he grew up with nothing, just like the most other people in his community. Unfortunately, Luis Diaz's family were so poor that they couldn't even afford 3 square meals. But in fact, he is very lucky to be alive today because statistics show that 4,770 children of Vayu died of malnutrition in the 8 years between 2008 and 2016. Like other children of his community, he was also suffering from malnutrition. But Football saved him. When he first started playing football, his talent was unbelievable for everybody. He was becoming his family's hero. But his malnutrition problems made it hard for him to play football. Actually, he was very very skinny that his friends call him Fideo. Well, Fideo is the name of a noodle dish that's so popular in the South America. So people were basically telling him that he was so thin, he looked like a noodle. So what he actually did for his malnutrition problem? Well, he decided to train twice as hard to become one of the best footballers of all time like his idol Ronaldinho. In fact, every kid in South America wanted to play like Ronaldinho. Perhaps he really idolized the Brazilian goat Ronaldinho because he could relate to a story of his life. As we all know, Ronaldinho too came from nothing. But he became so successful that he saved his family from poverty. Well, after months of hard work, he finally signed with the first club of his career. Hopefully, the club put Luis Diaz on a diet plan so he could eat healthier and also gain a few pounds. After several seasons of playing in his first team, he proved to everyone that how talented he is. He had become so popular that instead of the Fidel, his friends called him Colombian Cristiano Ronaldo. Fortunately, he managed to get many offers from big clubs like Brighton, Zenit, Cardiff City and Porto. But what was the reason that he chose Porto among all these clubs? In fact, Diaz was convinced to join Porto by his competitors Falcao and James Rodriguez, who had previously played for the Porto. So he made that move to Europe and surely now he will be very thankful to those Colombians legends for their advice. Finally now, after lots of hard work, Luis Diaz officially became the Liverpool player. The Colombian Cristiano Ronaldo understood that going from poverty to a football star was a blessing. So now, being a position to accomplish greatness and having the power to motivate millions of people, he vowed to give football as everything and make it known to the entire world that anything is possible.